Much of what we know about the reign of the Moors was discovered in works of art. And although the artist of this painting is unknown, it tells us a lot about the Lisbon of its time. When you look at a painting online, you can only see so much. Oh, but the way that knight is painted is so beautiful. He's so noble. Yeah. And his eye is on a completely different horizon. My understanding of the painting becomes dramatically different when I can actually see the interactions going on. When I look at like the people who are lower caste dressed, you see a mix of different nationalities. When you say or it's a nation I wouldn't even say nationalities, but like cultures. Cultures, yeah, yeah. When you say it's different from what you imagine, mm -hmm. what does that mean? Okay, well, there's more black people, <laughs> first of all, because the image becomes some images you can't tell if it's shadow. Sure. Look at this, this character, and it's my sensitivity because I am of African descent. You see this character being carried away by, what is it, security, which, mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. right? It's mm -hmm. not too different. I love how naive this painting is. It, 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 it's closer to the images I'm making than I thought. Mm. How these two men here, they're like in conversation. And again, I'm drawn to these moments of like mixed race interaction where mm. there isn't a higher, doesn't appear to be like a higher or hierarchy. Mm -hmm. Hmm. And see, these are things I, you can't tell until you see it. Now I can incorporate how the lace is made there, the hint of that. Oh, that face is gorgeous. They have weaponry, so they're of the order, possibly younger. But they're both men of color. Mm. I can stare at him forever.